Hey, what's up guys? Calum or Calum's Fish Tanks, and in today's video, I'm working on the 20 Long, which is just across from me over there. It's a tank you guys have never seen, but it is kind of covered in blackbeard algae, so I'm going to be using a method today to hopefully kill it right away, and then show you guys how after you've killed it to prevent it from coming back. So let's get started. So if you guys follow my Instagram, you've probably seen me teasing this for a while, but today I'm going to try to do a bleach dip to take care of this algae. Now this is something that's a little bit risky, but what I'm gonna do is try to test a bunch of different um, concentrations of how strong the solution is to let you guys know what maybe you should use and show you the results from all of those. So I think I'm gonna test a 2% and a 5% mainly, and uh, if neither of those work well, I'll, I'll test another one as well. So without further ado, I don't want to blab any longer. I'm going to go mix up those solutions and then show you guys me dipping some plants in them pretty much. So to make these mixtures for the 2%, I'm going to use 5 milliliters of bleach and then about 250 milliliters of uh, water. Now this isn't going to give exactly a 2% uh, solution, but it's close enough. And then for the 5%, I'm going to do 5 milliliters of bleach and then 100 milliliters of water to give me a 5% and that should be enough to dip what I'm trying to dip today because the rocks are going to be relatively small but I'm going to show you that now I'm probably going to try to hold them in there for about 30 seconds switch them around make sure to get all the BBA and then I'll show you guys what happens uh, when I take them out and let them sit for a while so it has been about a week since I tried that first solution that you last saw and I'll show the Anubias here so as you can see it killed some of the algae but most of it is still alive and that's because I found it wasn't in there long enough. So recently I retried the 5% mixture again and then left it in there for 2 minutes and I found that's about the right amount of time to leave uh, the plants in there to take care of the algae. So now there's a couple important things you have to keep in mind while doing this. And that's first off is some of that chlorine can be transferred to your tank. Now chlorine and water produce two products that aren't harmful to your fish. It just may make your water a little more basic. So you do want to really uh, wash off those rocks so your pH doesn't uh, raise too much. But I found that there is another chemical reaction that can happen with ammonias or nitrates that can make this toxic compound. So what you're going to want to do is keep your things in some kind of water bath for maybe an hour or two with a lot of uh, prime or another dechlorinator to take care of any bleach that may still be left on these plants. Another thing you have to remember is when you kill algae, all that stuff is just gonna go right back into your water column and it can just go right back into making algae again. So you're gonna wanna do a lot of heavy water changes. I'm doing them once a day, about 50%, to keep all those um, organics from building up because that's one of the main causes for black beard algae. So I'm doing a lot of water changes, very heavy, to make sure that this stuff doesn't come back. So this is not a permanent change if you don't um, fix what's causing it. So in my case with organics, maybe in your case it's something like uh, poor CO2 distribution or something like that. So you need to find the cause to this and change that. But heavy water changes will be needed, to, will need to be done because it's going to release a ton of nutrients back into your water column. So I hope you guys found this useful. Just make sure to rinse those rocks really good or plants, leave them in a water bath for a while with a bit of dechlorinator. But uh, yeah, that about does it for this quick little uh, hack. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was Kilm's Fish Tanks. Peace.